So you have a reputation for being kind of right? Yeah. I, Why? Maybe. Are you? Um, at times. Maybe. <laughs> are you? Are you like? Do you not hang out with the other tennis girls? Is that why people think that? Um, I'm not exactly. You know. You don't giving them fives in the shower. Right. But, yeah, it's not my thing. No, I, it's not. I get out of the locker room as fast as I can, but it's well, not that's, my hangout. That's good. I yeah. like that attitude. Yeah, you don't really give a <laughs> right? No. no. <laughs> okay. So, 13 years later, would you say you like Serena Williams? I respect Serena. <laughs> let's, let's talk about... Uh, Another I mean, how can I say that I like someone that's beaten me 19 times? <laughs> I mean, that would be so, so silly. <laughs> you work hard in the off-season, but you also took some time off this off-season and went on a little vacation. Where'd you go? I went to Costa Rica. Was that good? It was great. Can we talk about it? I don't think so. Hey, Maria. Hey, Stu. What's up? Uh... A supplier gave me these, and I figured, you know, if anybody could use them, you could, right? Yes, the giant worms can spring into my face. Nice try. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Come on, Maria. I was just trying to be thoughtful. You know what? Forget it. Whatever. I'm so sorry, Stu. Yeah, I mean... I just thought... <laughs> You're evil. Can we get that can back? Maria, you're going to be playing someone who's either a bit sick or a bit injured. How do you feel? Um, I feel good, thank you. <laughs> Last question here. I know you don't like to talk about your personal life, so of course we will. So, I'm not going to ask. I'm not going to ask you about anything personal. Just tell me what you what you look for in a guy. Are you kidding me? <laughs> well, he doesn't have red hair. <laughs> I already knew that. I'm sensing a trend here in Australia about that. What else? Uh, <laughs> that's, that's about it. I'm not going to give too much away. I mean, they have to work for it. You know, they got to keep me guessing. You know, I like variety. All right. You think it's possible? Are you sure about this one? I'm ready. <laughs> <laughs> we go again, wait. Give me best shot. <laughs> <laughs> New balls, please. <laughs> Get some match up. <laughs> and please don't do it anymore. <laughs> you just it's just like releasing the energy right it's just I'm not sure what it does no. yeah I don't know I still to this day don't really know but what happens if you don't do it uh, I don't probably nothing it would oh, be the same I was like who's streaking now that's you that's you didn't get me a present or maybe it's somewhere behind the desk. oh I got you a present the boss <laughs> are you uh, w w how, how many tournaments do you play in a, a year um, I usually... <laughs> All right. <laughs> no comment. I know. Um, kind of an ugly image, isn't it? Right. Yeah. Любопытный эпизод и последний удар в этом матче Мария нанесла 
левой рукой. В юношеском теннисе подобные матчболы, когда последний удар. Анна Корнакова из России. Это Excuse me, is anyone sitting here? I'm sorry, I'm off. Actually, no, go ahead. Thank you. Šarapovové toho bylo napsáno strašně moc. Na internetu najdete nejrůznější životní příběhy. Je to samozřejmě... And you will find out how strong she is. People usually call you a fighter. How about being a tea bag? Uh, can you explain that to me? Uh, you, you, you don't drink. You don't drink tea. We I don't tea bag into hot water. And I'm a big tea drinker, but I don't understand what she means. <laughs> mean, just mean how strong it you. Um, that's great. Uh, she's very creative. <laughs> I, mean, I, guess, I guess she could have put it many different ways. And she she chose the English version. <laughs> How's that? A, 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 a fighter and tea bag? You, you can relate to. I artists. think it, I think it's better to ask her than me. Obviously, she has a better sense of what's going on out there. <laughs> an IQ of 175. <laughs> I don't know who's ever measured their IQ. I don't know. Marion Bartoli. She does? Yeah. Who's ever measured their IQ? Uh, you know, in, in such a tough tournament, such um, you know, difficult opponents, um, you know, I was able to win this tournament and, you know, so unfortunate. Vico was um, extremely injured today and uh, extremely injured today and, um, you know, just couldn't, couldn't really perform her game. And, um, but I'm really happy to be the champion here for the first year, so. Great. I'm the winner, so whatever she wants to call it is fine with me. Well, well, well. A double fault, and it's another break. And we are back on service. <laughs> Is that dangerous? Yes, he said. It's never easy to to be the one that's on the losing end of an event, especially at Wimbledon. Um, but to to look at things in perspective and to see where I was just a few weeks ago, um, I had no idea what my result would be here. So. I could, I think, for many others, and maybe if I was British, a semi-final would be incredible. <laughs> you know, I'd be, I'd be on the front page. I'd be on the front page of the paper. But, I mean, <laughs> I know that. But I expect myself to be a champion of these events, and it's disappointing to, to come out as a loser. Yeah.